For this demonstration, I'm using the Scarlet Solo, and it's pretty similar to all the other um, interfaces out there that are newer. So first, I have a mini to RCA stereo cable. I'm putting a, an adapter on it so I could plug it into the headphone port. Now keep in mind, I'm assuming you have monitor speakers hooked up and you are using the two outputs on the back. So that's why I'm taking it out of the headphone output uh, to get this audio into my iPhone. So now we're gonna get the Behringer UCA202, Behringer U Control Interface. It's a smaller interface that takes the analog signal and converts it to a USB connection. So this is crucial in connecting it to your smartphone. Now I'm going to turn the gain up for um, the audio, so that'll be your main control knob for the volume level going into your live stream. And there's my smartphone. I'm using the iPhone 10, and it just plugs in through a USB to lightning adapter, which is the white adapter connected to my smartphone. And make sure to turn direct monitoring off, else you will get a doubling of the signal, and that will not sound very good. I'm in Reaper, which is a free DAW you can download online. I have the two inputs here, which is for the vocal mic and the piano, which is my red Nord keyboard. Now I'm going to take a look at the plugins you could put in here. Anything you want, basically. So I'm using the UADX Pure Plate. This is a UAD Spark plugin, which does not require Apollo to run. So um, this is a simple reverb that I am going to put on my vocal mic and uh, just adjust the settings and do it to your taste, whatever you like. You could also add any other plugins there. Keep in mind, if some are too big or complicated, they might introduce latency. And for the piano, I just simply have um, nothing on there. I'm just gonna be using the onboard reverb uh, that's in my keyboard. So as long as you have the record input enabled on here, that's how are you going to get some signal flow into your live stream, so make sure the tracks are armed. Okay, you hear the reverb? Okay, so that is a basic test here in Instagram on my reels. Okay, it's the same thing here, only we're on TikTok now for a 60 second video. Once again, the reverb is on the microphone and here's the piano. Jazzy, all right. Well, I hope that answered your questions. If you have more troubleshooting things you want to go over, uh, just let me know in the comments if you want me to review any interface or anything in particular that's giving you trouble. Also, if you want to join my free mini course that I'm offering, just when you sign up on my email list, you'll get access to some more videos of this nature. So that's in the description as well. And thanks again. Um, check out this next video.